China's reusable space plane has just completed an extraordinary 267-day mission, marking a pivotal achievement in space technology. This top-secret spacecraft launched in December 2023, spent over eight months in orbit, and performed highly advanced maneuvers like rendezvous and proximity operations with a smaller satellite. This mission is a major leap forward for China, showcasing its growing mastery of reusable space technologies and positioning itself alongside global players like the US. Let's explore how this mission could change everything. China's reusable space plane mission is a major milestone in its space program, showcasing technological advancements that bring it closer to dominating the reusable spacecraft market. This mission, which lasted an impressive 267 days, began on December 14, 2023, when the spacecraft was launched aboard a Long March 2F rocket from the Jiuquan spaceport. The ability to keep the space plane operational in orbit for such a prolonged period similar to its second mission which lasted 276 days highlights China's increasing confidence in the durability and reliability of its space technology. A key achievement of this mission was the further testing of reusable technologies that could revolutionize how space travel is approached. Reusable spacecraft reduce costs dramatically by eliminating the need for completely new hardware for every mission. The ultimate goal is to create an efficient, cost-effective solution that enables regular and reliable access to space, whether for commercial, scientific, or military purposes. This spacecraft's repeated success is paving the way for China to establish itself as a leader in reusable space technology, much like the US, with its X-37B space plane. One of the hallmarks of the mission's success is how smoothly the landing process was executed, though details remain sparse due to China's characteristic secrecy. What we do know is that the spacecraft landed at the Lopnur site in China's Xinjiang region, a location also used in previous missions. Astrophysicists and satellite observers predicted the landing based on the spacecraft's orbital trajectory, and their estimates closely aligned with the actual return. A major aspect of this mission's importance lies in its technological developments that make future space missions more efficient. By fine-tuning these reusable systems, China aims to significantly cut down on the time and cost between missions. For instance, the intervals between the landings and relaunches of this space plane have been gradually decreasing, with only seven months between its second and third missions. This reduction in downtime is a clear indicator that China's reusability technology is advancing quickly. An intriguing aspect of China's reusable space plane missions is its ability to perform rendezvous and proximity operations RPO in space. These maneuvers, which involve close quarters interaction between the spacecraft and other objects in orbit, have been central to both the second and third missions. During this latest mission, the space plane was observed releasing a smaller object, likely a satellite, into orbit. Shortly after, the main spacecraft began conducting proximity operations with it, RPOs are highly technical operations that require precise navigation and control. The ability to carry out these maneuvers allows for several practical applications in space. For example, a space plane capable of approaching and interacting with satellites could repair, refuel, or retrieve malfunctioning satellites, thereby extending their operational lifespans and reducing the need for costly replacements. Additionally, RPO technology could be used to retrieve scientific samples or even space debris a growing concern in Earth's orbit. But the uses of RPOs aren't limited to peaceful purposes. In a military context, such capabilities could be applied to monitor, disable, or interfere with adversary satellites. This dual-use technology means that space planes with RPO capabilities could potentially carry out anti-satellite missions, making them a valuable asset in both national defense and offensive space operations. While China has emphasized the peaceful nature of its space plane missions, the potential for military applications can't be ignored, especially in light of the growing tensions in space between major powers. During the third mission, observers reported that the space plane conducted its proximity operations in June, though details remain scarce. This aligns with the secrecy surrounding the mission, as China has yet to release official images or in-depth reports on the spacecraft's design or objectives. Nonetheless, Amateur astronomers have managed to track and photograph the spacecraft, 
providing a glimpse into its activities and validating the claim that RPOs were conducted. These operations showcase China's ambitions in becoming a space superpower. The ability to perform complex maneuvers like RPOs puts China in a league with the US, whose X-37, B space plane has been performing similar missions. The X-37, B often used for testing new technologies and potentially military operations, is seen as the closest analogy to China's space plane. The success of China's reusable space plane mission signals a larger strategic goal to establish China as a dominant player in space exploration and technology. This mission is just one piece of a larger puzzle that includes plans for a two-stage-to-orbit system which could drastically alter the landscape of space travel. A fully reusable system would make space exploration more sustainable, allowing for more frequent missions with lower costs. This would benefit not only national space agencies, but also commercial ventures, paving the way for a new era of space commercialization. China has long been developing reusable spacecraft as part of its broader space program. This particular mission builds on earlier successes with suborbital spacecraft, which have been tested since 2021. Together, these systems aim to form the backbone of a reusable space transportation infrastructure. The long-term goal is to create a system where spacecraft can be launched, returned, and relaunched with minimal downtime. This is similar to what companies like SpaceX are doing with their reusable rockets, but China's focus on space planes adds a different dimension to the reusability conversation. One of the most exciting aspects of this space plane mission is its potential for future commercial applications. Reusable spacecraft drastically reduce the cost of sending payloads into space, making it more accessible for companies and researchers alike. If China can refine this technology to the point where launches are affordable and frequent, it could open the door to a new wave of space-based industries. These could range from satellite deployment and maintenance to space tourism and even resource extraction from asteroids. Additionally, China's space plane program aligns with its broader geopolitical ambitions. As the space race intensifies, nations are vying for dominance not only in space exploration but also in space-based defense and communications. The ability to deploy, repair, or even disrupt satellites gives countries a strategic edge, especially in times of conflict. By developing advanced space plane technology, China is positioning itself as a key player in this arena. Its successful missions are a clear indication that it intends to compete with established spacefaring nations like the US and Russia. However, it's not just about competition. The technology being tested on this space plane could have far-reaching implications for humanity's future in space. By making space travel more affordable and accessible, China could play a crucial role in the expansion of human activities beyond Earth. Whether it's building space stations, establishing lunar bases, or mining asteroids, the possibilities are endless. This reusable space plane is just one step toward realizing those ambitions. China's reusable space plane mission marks a new era in space technology, demonstrating the country's growing expertise in spacecraft reusability. From its ability to stay in orbit for extended periods to performing advanced proximity operations, this space plane is a testament to China's ambitions in the global space race. The mission's success underscores the importance of reusable technologies for making space exploration more efficient and affordable. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more updates on space exploration and scientific discoveries. See you next time.